Hello everybody, my name is Devour and welcome to an episode of Dedabam! And I'm gonna play through the tutorial today. I know that's exciting for a lot of you. But I guess there's been some people in the comments that have said that they need a more in-depth look at the game. So that being said, what a what better place to start than the tutorial Makes itself? Me happy. Alright, so this shouldn't take horribly long, so you guys will have a short video for today. I'll try to get more in-depth with uh, the tips that they give, but mostly it's just going to be following through the tutorial, because you know it's here, you just got to figure out how to use it. The grain of the face. Welcome to our humble training center. Do come on in. Come on in. Okay, so, WASD, obviously. Um, if you don't ever play first-person shooters, you should at least know that. This is our main line into the London Space is all basic stuff. Mercs jump up, uh, jump up, up, up. And the mouse to look around. All right, we're still on the very, very basics. There. You can crouch with left control, depending on. I mean, you could change your settings, now, but that's the default. The Sprinty sprint. Oh, I can't fire at anything. I haven't played this tutorial yet, so I may still learn a thing or two. Right then. Combat basics. All mercs have a primary and a secondary weapon. Switch to your secondary. Alright, secondary you can use two or scroll. Switch back to your primary weapon. I use two just because that way you can switch to your knife quicker. And you press E to drop your ammo. Ah, I can't tell you how many times. That I've had to tell people in game how to do that. Now, mouse one to fire. We're all on the same page there. Go for headshots. Ooh, the next section already. God, we're so advanced, guys. Looking for Easter eggs. So run through the corridor. Melee weapon obviously lets you get faster. You can do wall jumping too. Wall jumping is much, much better. Movement is vital. Only crouch or use iron sights when you can't help it. Otherwise, keep moving. Yeah, so running around in circles is key. In combat, you do not stop. Keep shooting, keep taking out your enemies, and keep moving towards the objective. Here's That's the right. Take out all the dummies and reach the exit as quick as you can. Three, two, oh boy, throwing us right into it. Check this out. Oops. I don't forget about anybody. They're all included. Oh, come on, that was the worst. Keeps you moving. He's faster than aiming down the sights. That was so bad. Oh, come on. Let me go through it again. That was fun. Alright, so we're about to learn more. The story is, always be moving. Don't stop to shoot. A stationary target is a dead target. So make yourself a harder shot and always keep moving towards the objective. The only exception to that is when you hop on the MG turret. And sometimes snipers, because you kind of have to stop for a second to make a good shot. But, yeah, yeah. Okay, this guy's pushing. There is a lot of toxic gas pockets in the contaminated zone. If you try to move through gas, you will be in trouble, like our poor dummy friend here. Oh. Whoa, what the fuck? Repair that nearby generator to clear the gas. Dave! Good. Your buddy's down, but I'll get you, bro. Press G to get them up. That's how you do that. G is the action key for me. if it's safe to do so, pick him up yourself. Ammo with E again. Now remember. Oh, right now. What was I gonna say? To her, see what's going on. So you can go in your key bindings if you don't like the settings I'm using. You go to controls 
and you can change everything in here. And I gotta change the aura. You can switch with F2. We'll get through this second part of it. Aura's sexy. Oh yeah. Aura, combat medic. Good to have you with us. Head on through to the med bay. You are a medic, so you have defibs, which help your teammates up faster. Getting them back on their feet is only half of it. If your teammates need healing, and they will, you can deploy a portable health station to patch them up. Okay, you can press... There's an alternate button for your secondary weapon objective. Deploy your health station. It's Q for me. Q Over and E are the switch for me. Everyone Keep in mind, when you're defibrillating, you can charge it up longer to give them more health, or you can just quickly pop it. Okay, we're done here. Let's check back in with Skyhammer. Maybe he's ready to blow some stuff up. Alright. So as long as you know that, that's the basics of it. Press down heal station Q, revive with E, hold it down longer to revive people with more health. And back to Skyhammer. This is kind of a neat tutorial. I don't think I've ever played this. Which is probably why... 90% right, of people haven't played it either. The path is blocked, so get up on the balcony and we'll blow it open. I agree. Throw the marker to call in an airstrike on the generator. Okay, I got to I got to go through this. All right, so if you press 4, you can get out your giant grenade or you can press Q, but it's harder to walk okay, left an and press Q at the same time. So I always use 4 just for that very reason. Then you can click and hold and still jump and move and whatnot. That really helps. Oh yeah. But you've been hired for an urgent mission. So go take care of business and we'll catch up on this later. What the hell is that? Urgent mission, eh? Let's do this. I'm going through the first through this the first time just as you guys are. Okay. That's just a segue to move right into it. That's cool. Is it like an advanced thing? Huh, I guess not. Let's see if we can uh, do one run through the assault course as well. This will kind of show you guys the basics of it. I'm not doing a speed run by any means. Yeah. We'll test your combat effectiveness soon enough. I'm good at this, but I'm not great at it. Movement. Oh, okay. I guess it's a tutorial. Equip your knife to move more quickly. To wall jump, jump on a wall and jump again is There we go. That's it. Changing Catch that? with wall jumps is the fastest best way to get around. So you can jump off a wall by just hitting space off of it. And I like Ladders this. are slower and leave you more exposed than wall jumps. So look around for alternatives. Like so. Jump off walls all the time. It's exactly moves you further and faster than a standard jump. Right. Long jumps are an advanced technique. Don't worry too much if you can't do them straight away. Feel free to skip this bit and practice it in your own time. This takes a lot of practice to master. Long jumps and long jumps to take shortcuts. So if you're holding down shift or run. While running, press control and space oh, the at the exact same time. On. And that lets you jump over stuff, like, really far. That's your advanced jump. I taper them off, so I hit I hit control and space right next to each other. But it's so close that it lets me do it. That's why you hear it twice on mine. So practice the shit out of that. You'll get good at in no time. Alright. you ready to start? Shoot the dummy. Then on three. All right, one try, guys. One take. Here we go. Shoot the dummy to start the Holy shit! I fucked that up already. Let's restart it. I'm gonna get a good run, guys. We'll give the course another go to improve your score. Give it hammer. 
Ah! Jesus fucking Christ. I'm choking bad. No time to reload. God damn it. Come on. Come on, damn it. Ah, oh, damn it. Ah, oh, I fucked this up too. Got bullets for you. Chain your wall jumps. <laughs> I'm screwing this up so bad. Oh no. Damn it, I really fucked this up so bad. Fan blood fantastic. Nice. That's actually uh, good. Have a look at the scoreboard. I got gold, but it's not even not even close to my potential. Thirteen hundred. God, that's so bad. I'm gonna give it one more shot and that's it. And I'm done. I'm gonna try not reloading. See if that works out. It's all about the good start, guys. There we go. Oh gosh. Hell yes. Ah, come on. Hell yes. Ah. Come on, damn it. That was even worse than my last time, I think. That's actually pretty good. No, it was a little better, but not by much. All right, that's it, guys. I don't have a lot. I don't have a lot of room for improvement there. I'm not a cobalt rank, that's for sure. I'm gold one. <laughs> so if you guys enjoyed this video, hit the thumbs up button, share, comment, and subscribe down below. I'll get some more tutorials out later, and we'll see if we can improve on some more stuff. So until next time, guys, try not to die.